Hello guys, this is Charles 1K92 here, also known as GM65 on the PlayStation Network. So, we're just continuing off where we left off, and that is <clears throat> where Ezio comes back to Forley, uh, not Forley, uh, Florence, and meets up with uh, Leonardo da Vinci, and he is talking to Ezio about this man that we're supposed to meet here in the market who goes by the name La Volpe so apparently he must be in this area and we have to find him so we might find ourselves a thief or I don't know someone who matches La Volpe's uh, description Now, if at any moment I seem to uh, stop playing, I've got a small little dog here who uh, is quite naughty at times, so I might have to discipline her a little bit, which is what I'm doing at this moment. I'm just making sure she doesn't do anything. Just sit still for a minute. There we go. She behaves when she wants to. So where could this thief be, I wonder? What? My pouch! Oh, my money! Your money! I don't have your money! <laughs> Get back here! Make me! You're making a big mistake. I really have no interest in hurting you. So give me back my money and we'll call it even. Not so fast. What do you want? Who are you? They call me many things. <laughs> Murderer. Tagliagole. Thief. But you may call me La Volpe. At your service, Messer Ezio. <laughs> Do you know my name? <laughs> it is my business to know everything in this city. Isn't that why you're here? Indeed. I need to find someone. To know where he'll be before even he does. Who? Francesco de Pazzi. There's word on the street of a caravan just arrived from Roma. A secret meeting at sunset tonight. You can learn something of Francesco's whereabouts there. Do you know where it is to be held? Ma certo. Let me know when you are ready, and we'll go. Ah, yes. <laughs> Here is your money. Hmm. So that's La Volpe. Looks like a cool dude. And there he is just down there. Let's find out what he is. Date of birth is unknown. Ooh. There is almost no trace of La Valpe in the history books. The name obvious yeah. But for whom is anyone guess? Hmm. So he's chosen that name for a particular reason. Come on you. Behave, little dog. So <clears throat> La Valpe is reported to have robbed the Pope's carriage without any of his guards noticed, including the Pope, who was sitting inside the carriage. Wow. One night in 1467, he was seen on the rooftops of the Palazzo della Signoria, the Palazzo Medici, and Santa Croce, all at the same time. Some claim that he's immortal, never aging, while others say that his violet eyes can see through buildings, pursuing the contents inside. Hmm. That's kind of a bit of a legend, isn't it? And yet here he is. Come on, dog. You gotta just at least chill out for five minutes. Follow me, but we must move fast. Think you can keep up? That's your problem. 
See you there. No, now come on. You gotta be. <laughs> She's trying to bite my fingers. Come on. Can you just at least sit still for once? Otherwise, I have to put you back. Okay. She might calm down now. Bloody hell, she is being right now a nuisance. Alright, you know what, give us a few seconds and I will have to dis have to put her back. You've ruined this now. Ah. Alright, we're back. Come on, Avalpe. <laughs> what are you doing back there? I said to keep up with me. Here we are. Francesco Di Pazzi is meeting his people inside that church. How do I join them? There are catacombs that run under the city. They will lead you to a place where you can eavesdrop on the meeting. Grip that stone handle. Turn it, then slide it down. Thank you for all your help, Volpe. Hmm. Una fortuna. Hmm. So it seems we've got a location on where Francesco de Pazzi is going to be. There are guards near here. Hmm. Novella's Secrets.
A load of mechanisms. How long do we have to stand here, Saverio? It's so cold. What do you want, Ilario? Messer Pazzi is paying us good money to watch the entrance, and the dead won't try to murder us. I can't wait to go home to Elena and tell her how much gold we made tonight. Hmm. Looks like there are some guards here. Let's have a little bit of a wander around, see what we can find. Hmm. Hello. A hooded figure with the same kind of style of hood with a sword and shield. Interesting. Another one bites the dust. Let you that's so fast, Tronzo. Ouch. Okay, that's sorted. There are treasure chests in certain areas of the game, which they consider to be secrets. So if you find one, loot it. Don't be afraid not to. Okay, I think we might have to activate this. have to activate that one it seems. Well there's no timer so we can take our time doing this. There we go. Is there another chest in here? No. Watch while I go look. This was supposed to be an easy job. I told you we shouldn't have come here. If I hear anything, I'm running to the other guard post. So help me God. Hmm. That little shit's going to be a problem. I think this is where we're going to have to chase this guy. Saverio, I'll be back with the other guards. Saverio is dead, buddy. I have to find a way out before he kills me. Front 
Growing tired, buddy. Leave me alone. Guard, two arms, two arms. Oh. <laughs> Just made it in time. So what we can do is we can just walk over in here and the guards won't have a fucking clue. They're just busy playing their poker game. Hmm. Let's go and activate this. Dei omnipotentes, Patris et Fili et Spiritus Sancti, descendat super vos et maneat semper. Grazie, Padre. Bernardo? It's all here. Swords, staves, axes, armor, bows. Our men will want for nothing. I take this gift to mean the Pope consents. He gave his blessing to the operation, as long as nobody's killed. We're all set for the Duomo in the morning, Signore. The bait's been laid, but it wasn't easy. His fool brother keeps changing his plans. See, si. We'll need to be on hand to make sure Giuliano even gets out of bed for church tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> what is it, Jacopo? Do you think they suspect something? Impossible! The Medici are too arrogant or too stupid to even notice. Likely a bit of both. <laughs> Do not underestimate our enemies, Francesco. Or have you already forgotten how your son was murdered? We'll suffer no such surprises this time, Maestro. You have my word. Molto bene. I should be off. I have some other business to attend to before I return to Rome. Gentlemen, tomorrow a new sun rises over Firenze. May the Father of Understanding guide us. May the Father, May the Father of, of Understanding, understanding guide, us. guide us. Hmm. Seems they got a plan to deal with Lorenzo and his brother. Hello. Look at that statue. It's identical to one in the Villa Auditore. I think you've stumbled onto one of the assassins' tombs Ezio's uncle mentioned. Well, it'll be a shame to let this go to waste. Now that we know the way in, I'll tag the landmarks containing tombs in the database. Looks like it's time for us to head back out. The Seal of Darius. So when you do this first um, exploration underground you get a trophy for it called Undertaker. And you get other trophies as well for discovering each crypt. So. As Rebecca said, sure mark any locations that has um, these crypts and when you do get the seals you just take them back to the auditory, place them in their right place and it helps you get one step closer to unlocking the armour of Altair. Hmm. No 
where Francesco will be and when. But what is it? I overheard something. They have weapons, enough for a battalion. Even the Pope has given support. Mm. Typical of Sixtus, but... What the hell are they planning? I couldn't understand the specifics, but it involves the Medici, and it begins tomorrow morning at the Duomo. The Medici will all be there for Sunday service. Along with the rest of Firenze. They're going to do it right in the middle of high mass. But it's also a chance for me to blend with the crowd, get close, and stop this madness. If they succeed, if we lose Lorenzo and Firenze falls to the Pazzi... It will not come to that. I promise. I hope you are right. Hmm. So secret tomb locations have been acquired now, so we can explore both Assassin and Templar tombs. Well, Templars don't necessarily have tombs, they more or less have, um... Vaults, as it were, constructed underneath particular places. So, I think there's one here in Florence, and there's another one, I believe, probably in Venice, I think? Or there's two, no, I think there's actually two in Venice, actually. Okay, so what I'm just going to do here is I'm just going to stop recording because I just need to uh, have a little bit of a break. So I will continue this on next time. <laughs>